Hey guys, it's Lauren Yates from Rave It Up here. And today we are at State Theatre for Bonnie Lithgow's new pantomime, Jack and the Beanstalk, starring Lucy Durack. And what makes this different from her other pantomimes is that it is in 3D. Let's have a look. Hello? Is anybody there? Yes. Who? Me! <laughs> is anyone there besides you and I? Yes. <gasps> Us. Oh, oh, I oh, command oh. you cease with the stupidity. Okay. We must find Princess Jill. Okay, all right. There's lots of gags and it's very silly, but yes, mm. I play Jack, Jack's brother, Aww. and um, yes, yeah, Simon, and it's so funny. Well, you look very so different silly. from Lockie Deering, so I, uh, <laughs> how's wow, that working? Wow, separated at birth, but <laughs> we had different. It's complicated. Okay, yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing the show. <laughs> it's theatre. <laughs> So how's Suspend it been? Suspend your disbelief for a moment. I know. I got to. I got to channel it that in a in a child. <laughs> <laughs> For the parents, it's like it's There's it's ridiculous. Hidden now, funny sometimes things in there, I yeah. think it's mostly for the parents. Hope for the parents, yes. <laughs> There's so many different. There's so many gags for the parents, and it's a good excuse for and them again, to come know, along, bring the kids. Yeah, absolutely, it's mm. a family show. You will not be disappointed. The parents leave every year going, "This is hilarious. Why do we think it's a kids show?" And in England, in Britain. It isn't. It's a fa it's a hundred percent family show. The bar goes off. The ca all the night shows sell out because the parents want to come and have a good time. Like that's yeah. how it works. We're here. We still think about it. it's. Oh, it's, is it a kids show? Yeah. So all the matinees sell. You know, and the night shows are a bit like. Oh, do I take my kids out for that? You yeah. Know, it's like no, come. You'll have a great time. So if, you know, if there's a message for all the parents out there, it's like you come because it's very very silly. What's that knocking? Oh, it was my knees. <laughs> Oh, thank goodness, I thought it was mine. The oh. short rehearsal time is part of it. It's supposed to be sort of like schlepped together a little bit, and it comes together so professionally, but therefore things do go wrong. People do, may slip a line or something, and mm. it's totally fun to walk off stage, get your script and come back on, because the audience is like, I, we don't ever see this ever. Yeah. No one ever, you it's don't refreshing. go to musical theatre and go, oh, yeah, Lucy Direct forgot her line. That, that never happens anyway, because Lucy's very professional. Yes. But, you know, they go, what? This doesn't happen. <laughs> or they, they won't even notice it's happened. With this, it's just like, draw attention to it, because it's hilarious when it does happen. Mm. And, you know, you've got Richard Reed up there. He's just, uh, I've worked with him a few Phenomenal. times in, in the lead up to this. He's just hilarious. He's very funny. Three towns, three towns, three towns, So when yeah. when you have a show like this where you got to mm -hmm. actually deliberately do things wrong yeah, yeah, as a yeah, gag, yeah. <laughs> do you find that it's like a, like a whole different type of acting, like making yeah. it look like an accident when it's not? <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's um, like if you just saw here, you know, there's the squeaky floor sort of thing. Yeah. You know, like it's it's funny when the sound guy plays it, you know, when it's not and supposed it screws to be. It up. Like, yeah. This is that's not how it works. You know, and they'll all be in on it, but. We just we sort of workshop that in rehearsal a little bit as well, and he'll just do it, and I'll react, and they're like, "It's in," you know. But he might do something <laughs> different the next night, and I'll just have to go with it. But there or are bit, like a big step are, you did. Yeah, and I was know, like, yeah. Really? Yeah, really? <laughs> like a step down? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> If you loved that, you definitely want to see the whole show. Jack and the Beanstalk will be here at State Theatre until the 21st of July, and you will not be disappointed. But for now, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you. <laughs>